Hello, people of the internet. My name is Johnny, and welcome to what might be the most controversial video on my channel. Today, we're going to be doing the FNAF characters bracket fight, where basically you go down the line, uh, bracket styled, like if we were in a tournament, and we pick our favorite characters. Let's say, you know, Freddy and uh, Funtime Chica. Let's say I pick Funtime Chica. Obviously, I won't do that because that'd be a really. Oh, I can't. Oh, I guess I have to do that. I can't, I can't put it back. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so. Uh, we make all the characters fight against each other, and then in the end, we find my favorite character in the entire franchise. It looks like it only goes to Pizza Sim. Because um, I'm not seeing any. Or, like, Custom Knight. Because Fredbear's here, but I'm not seeing any help wanted or special delivery characters. I saw Darko do this and I thought that it must be pretty difficult to pick from all of these characters to find your favorite one. So I thought, why not I do it? Try and find my favorite character. Uh, I already have a feeling right off the bat, someone is gonna have a little, <laughs> a little bit of a head start. If you guys don't know, I always say Chica's my favorite because she was the first character I saw. Is she really my favorite? I guess we're gonna find out in today's video. I also didn't really know where to put myself because if I put myself where I usually am, I'm kind of covering most of the characters, so I'm kind of awkwardly just in the middle. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so first up, Jack O'Barney or Yendo? You see, Jack O'Barney, he isn't, honestly, none of these... Neither of these guys are really that interesting to me. Uh, I guess Yendo kind of has the advantage because he's more mysterious. Uh, Jack, o Jack o Bonnie isn't even really canon. So, and he's, I think Darko said that he's just a reskin and he basically is just a reskin. When you think about it, all these characters are just reskins. Um, so yeah, he's not really very really interesting. Um, Yendo though... He, he's got that mysterious vibe to him. Vibe to him. You know? He's kind of a secret in Sister Location. Where you can see him sometimes in the Funtime Auditorium. And then he comes back in, um, in the Custom Night. Jack O'Barney, though... He doesn't really have a cool role in... Um, in uh, what was he in? The Halloween edition of FNAF 4. And then he didn't come back until Help Wanted. Where, again, he didn't really have that much of a... Uh, impact on it so Yendo he's he's just super cool so I'm gonna I'm gonna go with Yendo on that one now Belor or Toy Freddy I freaking hate Toy Freddy <laughs> I freaking hate Toy Freddy it's mainly because of Custom Knight he's not a bad character but it's just like Toy Freddy and Foxy they've been ruined for me like they've been ruined because of Custom Knight uh Belor though uh, she's not really interesting either she's just kind of a awkward side character there's not really anything interesting about her <laughs> toy freddy you know he's he's toy freddy um i don't know i did used to know um below his theme crumbling dreams on the piano so i guess that's kind of got an advantage there so i think i'll pick below her. now dd or phantom freddy god i don't like either of them dd is another character that was ruined because of custom night phantom freddy he doesn't do anything this guy doesn't even kill you. Well, I guess Dee Dee doesn't kill you either. Uh, I don't know. It's it's a tough choice against two not very interesting characters. You you feel me? Uh, just every time I hear Dee Dee into a stupid tune singing towards me in Custom Night, I just God PTSD from that freaking Vietnam flashbacks. Uh, and Phantom Freddy. What does he do? What does he do? He's not really interesting. There was that whole debate on whether it was Phantom Freddy or Phantom Golden Freddy. But besides that, he's not really interesting. Dee Dee's not interesting either. Go with Phantom Freddy. Why not? Okay, so Jack or the the, uh, wait, the, those are the Electro Babs. So the Electric Babs. Electro Bab. They don't do anything either. And then Chica's just another reskin. She, again, she's just like Jack O'Bonny. She doesn't really have an interesting role and all that, man, I'm just revealing a lot about these characters, <laughs> my, my, my opinion of these characters in this video, aren't I? Like, you don't really have an interesting role. Electro Bab, you're in one damn game. I'm, I'm just gonna go with, um, 
Jack Ochika, because she was... At least she's been in more than one game, you know? Electro Bab, you did have a cool role um, in Sister Location Custom Night, but besides that, you don't really have anything going for you. You're literally just the Biddy Bab, except you have a different mechanic. Now, Withered Golden Freddy or Scott Cawthon? Is that Scott? Because in Darker's video, he said that was Omnidude. So I guess we'll count it as Omnidude. Again... Another kind of tough choice, and this time it's between two characters that I love. Withered Golden Freddy, he's really cool. He's really cool. He made a, uh, he's made his debut back in 2014 for FNAF 2, and then he came back in Custom Night. And then Omnidude, he was like the main final guy in FNAF World. Um, hmm. Tough choice, tough choice. I guess I'll go with Golden Freddy because... Sorry, sorry, Scott. Um, but Omnidude doesn't really have that much of a backstory behind him. He's just kind of there as a reference to Scott. If it was, if there was a picture of Scott there, I would be picking Scott immediately. Um, but it's not. It's it's Omnidude. So yeah, there's that. Bon Bon or Happy Frog? We don't even have to debate this. Happy Frog, you're worthless to me. <laughs> Most of the mediocre melodies, they're just kind of there. <laughs> People always forget that they were thing. Hey, look, Freddy's too. Rockstar Foxy or Funtime Foxy? <sighs> oh, God. Rockstar Foxy, he is... I like him because of his parrot. I'm not gonna lie. I just like him because of the parrot. Funtime Foxy, though, I love. I love both of them. My favorite part about Funtime Foxy is in the trailer for Sister Location when his face just, like, splits open. That's so cool. I remember the, uh, the reveal for the Funtime characters. That was insane. Their face plates coming apart. That was absolutely insane. Funtime Foxy or Rockstar Foxy? The fight of the Foxies. Um, I'd probably go with Funtime Foxy, but it's also Rockstar Foxy. I mean, both of them are voiced by Joe, right? I think... So no matter what, I got Joe on my side. <laughs> also, I think nostalgia is going to play a huge part in this because I'm leaning towards Funtime Foxy, but that's only because he's been around for longer than Rockstar Foxy. And also, he's had the most appearances. Uh, Sister Location, and then also um, came back for Custom Night, and then he's also in Help Wanted. So yeah, I'm going to go with Funtime Foxy. Funtime Chico with a Phantom Puppet. Again, Phantom Puppet doesn't really do anything. I don't really like the Phantoms. I like their design. It's just they don't do anything. <laughs> they really, they literally don't do anything. Because they don't kill you. All they do is mess you up. And that just annoys me. So I'm just, I'm just going to go with... Uh, what, what, who, not Fun Time Chica. Rockstar Chica. Awesome. Chica or Lefty? Ah, uh, this shouldn't be a tough choice. Thing is, again, I like the nostalgia of Chica. And I like the backstory of Lefty. But, when you think about it, Lefty is just kind of a cover-up for the rest of the puppet story. Because my theory for um, the development of Pizza Sim has always been this. In the back of the survival logbook, there's that Scrap Chica. And my, my theory is, has always been Scott was going to add in a Scrap Chica, but didn't because he wanted to close the book on, um, on the puppet story, finally um, capturing the puppet and... That's why Lefty's there. So, to me, Lefty is kind of just a filler animatronic. He's interesting. He's very, very interesting. I love his um, his blueprints and his backstory and all of his mechanics. But he's he, when you really think about it, he's just kind of filler. So, uh, also, Chica, like I said, first animatronic I ever saw for the franchise. So, there's that. Or Villa Scrap Baby. Scrap Baby all the way. <laughs> Sorry, man. But, again, it's not really another mediocre melody. Uh, Chipper or Helpy? Chipper or Helpy? Chipper or Helpy? They're both cute, and I like both of them. Uh, Helpy or Chipper? Again, another decision that probably shouldn't be as tough as I'm making it out to be. Chipper or Helpy? Helpy is just... He's just kind of there. But Chipper, Chipper's the thing that started it all. But he's also not really a FNAF character, if you know what I'm saying. Like, the test is called... Fun half characters, and Chipper is not a 
FNAF character. I guess he is because he's in, he's in FNAF world. Also, Scott said in the interview that he's the thing looming over everything. So, there's that. I don't... I don't know. Why is this Why is this one in particular so tough? Why? I'm gonna go with Helpy. Again, Chipper, you're not really a FNAF character, but uh, but Helpy, he's, just, he's so cute. Okay, so, Golden Freddy or Withered Freddy? The original Golden Freddy. Yellow Bear himself. Or Withered Freddy. See, Withered Freddy's like the face of the merchandise. Literally everything about the mer merchandise is just this guy. But then also Golden Freddy. Uh, I feel like I'm gonna go with what Darko said in his video, is that if there was a game, if there was a game with the unwithered withered animatronics, I would probably pick Withered Freddy. But because we don't, we don't have that, I'm gonna pick FNAF 1 Golden Freddy. Trash and the gang and Endo. Trash and the gang. They were, so, they were just like healthy, they're cute. And unlike the mediocre melodies, they are funny. I just, I love the concept of that, it's so funny. Okay, so Phantom Mangle or Shadow Freddy? Phantom Mangle. Uh, I do really like the mangles. I do really like the idea of the mangle. It's just... Shadow Freddy, he's such a mystery. We still don't really know what he means. And he's like five years old. Okay. Oh, Funtime Freddy or Mangle. Bah, I just said that I like the mangle. Oh, but Funtime Freddy, he's got Bon Bon. And there's also Kellen. I feel like I'm just saying the same thing Darko says. Oh my god, what, what, is with, what is with this quiz and tough choices? Funtime Freddy, again, the first reveal of Funtime Freddy with his face, like, just, you know, he's standing there, he looks towards you, and his face plates open up. It's just a mangle, but he, he, the mangle's so cool. The, just the concept of the mangle and the backstory behind it, you know. We still don't fully know what Funtime Foxy looks like, I'm pretty sure. I don't think we know yet. There's also that bit of mystery to the mangle. And Funtime Freddy. Oh, but I love Funtime Freddy. Oh, but I love the... Oh my god, we still have so much more to do. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, yeah. Is that Fred Bear or the puppet? Are you kidding me? Okay, no no spoilers just yet. I think I'm gonna go with the mangle. I think I'm gonna go with the mangle. I, I just thought about, you know, back, back to the early days of FNAF 2. And then also when we got their voice in Custom Night, I just... I gotta go with the I'm sorry, Kellen. <laughs> God, I wish I could pick both, but that's not how this works. Rockstar Freddy or Toy Chica? See, I don't... They're both just characters that I acknowledge. I don't really prefer one or the other, one over the other. They're just kinda... Oh my God. With a body of shadow body. Oh my God. Okay, Toy Chica or Rockstar Freddy? How long has this been here? <laughs> Toy Chica or Rockstar Freddy? Damn. I guess Toy Chica is a bit more nostalgic. And Rockstar Freddy, he's just kind of annoying in <laughs> in Custom Night. The thing is, with the Rockstars, I feel like they're kind of... People don't really think about them as much because the main attractions of Pizza Sim were like other salvage characters. Scrap Baby, Afton... Uh, Molten Freddy, Lefty, all those guys. Security Puppet. If we can Security Puppet, I think of more than the Rockstar. So, um, I feel like also the toys, they're just, they're so, they're so memorable. Again, nostalgic's taking over me. Okay. Withered Bonnie or Shadow Bonnie? I freaking love Withered Bonnie. I freaking love Withered Bonnie. Shadow Bonnie, he's so mysterious. We don't really understand the Shadow character still, but with the Bonnie, he's so iconic. And he's so creepy. I, I have to. I just love his no face. He's got no face. I love that. It was so creepy. It was so creepy. I mean, I feel like there would be a, a riot outside my house if I didn't pick Mr. Hippo. <laughs> I do actually, uh, but I love Rockstar Bonnie's lines in Custom Night. Fridge. No, I gotta go with Mr. Hippo. I gotta go with Mr. Hippo. Uh, Freddy or... Uh, no debate there. Sorry, Funtime Chica. But there's, there's just no debate. 
Okay, now, Fred Bear or the Poopit? I feel like, and again, this is the same thing with the Withers. I feel like if there was a game dedicated to Fred Bears, Fred Bears Family Diner, I would probably pick Fred Bear. But since there's not, gotta go with the puppet. The thing that really started it all, also it's like, it's Henry's daughter, so, yeah. Okay, moving all the way back here. We're, we're done with that row. Spring, Barney, or Foxy? Again, Foxy, you're, you've kind of ruined it because of Custom Night, but also Spring, Barney. We don't have a game about you yet. You honestly probably shouldn't even be in this list because we don't know anything about you, so. Foxy all the way. Nightmare Barney or Molten Freddy? Molten Freddy all the way. Nightmare Barney, you're cool. And I really like you. I really like you. You were terrifying in the FNAF 4 trailer, but just you don't have the same impact as Molten Freddy. Music Man Nightmare. No competition there. Love you, Music Man. I love the um, the songs that Matthew makes you sing in some of his YouTube videos. I love those. Uh, Scrap Travel. Again. <laughs> Again, Mediocre Melodies. No competition there. Toy Bonnie or Nightmare Mango. Okay, well, this is what I get for going quick with these guys. Nightmare of Mangle or Toy Bonnie? Uh, I don't know. Nightmare of Mangle, I... You're cool and all. You're cool. But, Toy Bonnie. You're cool, but Toy Bonnie. I feel like if Nightmare of Mangle were in more games and they had a bigger impact in said games, I feel like I would pick you. But, cause like, what is Nightmare Mangle in? FNAF 4? And then Custom Night. FNAF 4, you're just replacing Foxy, you don't really add anything. You are very cool though. And then Custom Night, you just had a reused mechanic. You literally had the same mechanic as two other characters. So I gotta go with Toy Bonnie. Again, I feel like if Nightmare Mangle was used better, I would pick, I would pick them. Yeah, okay, so that line is done, so we go back up here, I think. I don't know. Yendo or Blore? Yendo or Blore? I don't know. <laughs> Yendo, again, the mysteriousness to him. And then Blore, you're just, you're just there. Blore's just kind of there. Not, like, there's not really been many interesting theories about Blore. And I don't really like the idea of her being Afton's wife. I don't... Like, why would he kill his wife? I don't know. Um, Jago Chico or Phantom Freddy? Again, two characters that are just kind of there. Phantoms, I, I just tolerate. And then Jacko Chica. You're cool. I think I have to pick Jacko Chica just because of her voice. Because Phantom Freddy, he doesn't have a voice. So I think I gotta pick Jacko Chica just over her voice. And I feel like that's the only thing going for her right now. Because again, just like Jack O'Bonny, she is just another Wii skin. Um, ooh, Withered Golden Freddy or Bon Bon? Bon Bon's cute, and Withered Golden Freddy is iconic. Again, I feel like the only thing going for Bon Bon here is just how cute he is. And I love his pop vinyl. But Withered Golden Freddy, again, he's iconic. Iconic. I, I have to. I have to. Okay, so. Uh, Funtime Foxy or Rockstar Chica? Funtime Foxy. Easy. So, Chica or Scrap Baby? Oh, nostalgia versus awesome design. Oh, frick. Chica or Scrap Baby? I feel like if Chica had a voice, if Chica had a voice, I would totally pick her. But because she doesn't, I'm so, I'm so sorry, Chica. I, I have to. I'm so sorry, Chica. I'm, I'm so sorry. I have to. If you had a voice, you would be right here. But you don't. You need a voice. It's been five years. Get a voice. A proper voice, and not one that's going to be scrapped because Scott doesn't like it. Okay. Helpy or Classic Golden Freddy? I gotta go. Classic. Actually, yeah, no, I gotta go. Helpy, you're cute and all, but again, just like Bon Bon, that's the only thing going for you. Um, Trash and the Gang and Shadow Freddy. I feel like, just because of the comedy of these guys, I'm gonna go with Trash and the Gang. <laughs> Again, if Shadow Freddy was a little bit more understood, then I would, I would totally pick you. 
thing is, like, uh, say another character, for example, Yendo. He's mysterious, but we know a little bit about him. Yendo, yellow, endo. He's the endoskeleton of, of I, um, uh, like, fun time Golden Freddy, I guess. Fun time Fredbear. Um, probably something, a secret project that William was trying to work on. Yeah, I got it. If you had a little bit more insight, that would be nice. Okay, so. Mangle or toy? I'm sorry, Mangle all the way again. Fucking love the design of the Mangle. Now, do I want to be truthful or do I want to be funny? <laughs> as much as I love Mr. Hippo and how hilarious he is, he is just another mediocre melody. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know. I'm so sorry, Mr. Hippo. Ten hour speech all the way. But I got. I got. He's so cool, his design is freaking incredible. And I love his voice in Custom Night. Freddy of the Puppet, are you f Freddy of the Puppet, Freddy is iconic and the puppet is crucial to the lore. Freddy of the Puppet, again, Freddy is iconic. He's Freddy. He was the first ever character to be designed, Scott said, I'm pretty sure. Um, but then there's the puppet, the thing that basically set all of this into motion. Freddy is cool. I like him a lot, and I love his new voice and special delivery, but it's the freaking puppet. Nothing can top the puppet. Foxy or Molten Freddy? No! No! I love his voice. I love the voice that Chris gave Foxy. And more than Freddy, your lines are just reused. Your, your design is awesome, though. It has a little bit of inconsistencies here and there with your eye color. But Foxy, he's so... Oh, I gotta go with Foxy. I gotta go with Foxy. If Kellen came back and he did new lines for Molten Freddy, I would be happy. If Molten Freddy is later added into special delivery, I would, I would probably pick, but I'm not going to. I have to. <laughs> Thing is... Nightmare Fredbear. I gotta go with Nightmare Fredbear. Let me explain why. Scrap Trap, or Afton, he's cool. I love him. But, he's so, so short-lived. He is so short-lived. His mechanic in Custom Night really is not all that interesting. Doesn't really suit Afton, in my opinion. And he's only in Pizza Sam. He, he, he's only in Pizza Sam. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say. So I gotta go with Nightmare Fredbear. He's fucking terrifying. When he's running at you in special delivery, not special delivery, and help wanted, that's terrifying. Especially in VR. Uh, yeah. Toy Bonnie. Oh, jeez. Toy Bonnie, obviously. Uh, Ned Bear or Phantom Chica. Ned Bear. L Ned Bear. Ned Bear. You're funny. You're really funny. But you don't do anything. Another mediocre melody. Law bit or Bitty Bab? Law bit. I just, I love the design of Law bit. Bitty Bab, you don't really do anything. You're creepy, and I like, I, I, I like you, but again, you're really only in sister location. When Law bit, Law bit's been making a damn comeback. They were in sister location, they came back for, um, custom night, they were in help wanted. Law bit's making a damn comeback, I'll give them that. With a cheek, I'm sorry, Balloon Boy. I gotta go with Withered Chica. I love her mouth. I love the design of Withered Chica's mouth. That's just terrifying. When you see her standing over you and in, in, um, T posing in front of you in um in the second game and in Help Wanted in VR, it's freaking terrifying. Having that mouth wide open. Ah, oh, it's terrifying. Bonnie or Nightmare Fredbear? I mean Nightmare Freddy. Well, this is an easy winner down here. Let's get that out of the way. Um. Bonnie or Nightmare Freddy? Bonnie, again, if you had a voice, man, I'd pick you all the way. I I'd pick Bonnie all the way, but he doesn't have a voice. Just doesn't have a voice. Nightmare on or Nightmare Foxy? Nightmare on or Night... Well, let's get this one out of the way. That's another easy one. Sorry, Midorinos. You don't really do crap. Plus, you're just annoying in custom night. Uh, Nightmare on or Nightmare Foxy? Nightmare Foxy, if you were in... Uh, if you were in Custom Night and you had a really good mechanic, I'd probably pick you. But Nightmare on, I love, I love their voice. I love his, I love his voice. I love it a lot. 
Okay, spring trap or plus trap? Spring trap, obviously. Nightmare or consequences? Nightmare, obviously. Candy Cadet or phone guy? Oh my god. I fucking love Candy Cadet. Ah. But I love phone guy. I quote phone guy all the time. I quote phone guy all the time. Even just on my own. And no one realizes it. Bonnet or baby? Baby, of course. Nightmare Chica or... What? Okay, well, let's get this out of the way. El Chip, you're, again, just kind of there. Uh, Nightmare BB, you, you, you just suck, man. You really suck. Okay, so let's go back up here. Oh, Foxy or Nightmare Fred? We're getting really close. We're getting really close to the final one. Final few choices. Okay, so Foxy or Nightmare Fredbear? Frick. <laughs> I love both their voices. I love... I love Fredbear's design. And I love how terrifying he is. I just... I love Foxy's voice. Chris did an amazing job with his voice. And again, I just... I keep thinking back to the Foxy ride. Captain Foxy's pirate adventure in Help Wanted. Like, that that wins me over. But Fredbear's design, he's... He's freaking awesome. Get out of here, Dust. He's freaking awesome. I'm sorry, Foxy. I love you, man. This is the toughest thing I've ever had to do. That's not the toughest thing. That's easy. That's easy. Um, that's another easy one. You're freaking terrifying. Um, Ennard or Nightmare? It's gotta be Ennard. It's gotta be Ennard. Uh, who? Nightmare or Foxy? I feel like if you... If Nightmare Foxy was in Custom Night, I would pick him in a heartbeat. But he's not. So... Sorry, man. We gotta, we, we gotta start going fast. We gotta start going fast. We've been doing this for a long time. Spring trap or nightmare? Nightmare again? You, you, you. I don't know. We don't really know anything about nightmare still. And again, he's five years old. Uh yeah. Phony or baby? Oh, phony. I'm so sorry. I gotta go, with baby. Well, backstory is awesome. Uh, nightmare baby or nightmare chica? Nightmare baby. I love his voice. He's got a damn good voice. Okay. Moving back over to this area. Okay. Yenard. 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 Where did... Where did Yenard go? Yenard. What are you doing? There we go. Yenard, obviously. Oh. Oh, no. Nostalgia, you are a piece of crap. Funtime Fox is so cool. I, I honestly just love the Funtime characters. If you haven't gotten that already. But with a... Golden Freddy, he's the he's the thing, he's the best, he's awesome, I love him. Damn, I hate this. This <laughs> is the worst. Nostalgia, you will not win over me. I feel like if Golden Freddy had his own game, if Golden Freddy had his own game, and if he had a creepy voice, oh I guess he does with Cassidy. Uh, does Cassie have a voice? I don't, I don't think Cassie does have a voice. I feel like... I gotta go with Funtime Fox. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna punch myself after this video. But I... I, I have to. I just... I want to know more about you. And if we... If you had a Fredbear game... even I don't, I don't even care for, if you weren't in there. If Fredbear Family Diner had its own game, you would be picked. But it doesn't. I'm sorry. Also, I love Funtime Fox's voice. One of my favorites. I really just love all these voices. Um, so yeah. Scrap Baby or regular Golden Freddy? Mm, I, just design-wise, I gotta go with Scrap Baby. She's so creepy. And her, her appearance, her special appearance in Pizza Sim just stole the show in the entire franchise. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Uh, where am I going to now? I guess here. So, Trash on the Gang or Mangle? Mangle, of course. Um, this is a weird one. Withered Bonnie or the Puppet? Mmm, design-wise, I would go with the Withered Bonnie. But lore-wise, I kind of, I, I gotta go with the Puppet. Voice-wise, I gotta go with the Withered Bonnie. The Puppet, you're just kind of... You have an interesting voice, but not really as interesting as with a Bonnie. Uh, thing is, like, they're, they're from the same game, so I can't use nostalgia as as my way out of this. So, I just, I gotta go with... The puppet is so important to the lore. 
And again, but the, but Wither Bonnie is so cool looking. <laughs> if you had your own game on Withered, I would pick you, but you don't. But I'm still, I still haven't decided yet. I gotta freaking pick one, but I can't. I'm gonna come back to it. <laughs> Uh, Nightmare, yeah, obviously. Toy Bonnie, you, no competition there, man. Uh, Withered. Come on! They're both fantastic design-wise. Ennard, you... Thing is with Ennard, he's cool, but... And, and he's, he's cool, he's really cool, but he's so short-lived again. He's so short-lived. He is so short-lived. He's in. He's at the end of Sister Location. You barely see him in a uh, in Custom Night. He's not in Help Wanted. If you had a Help Wanted mini game in the private room, oh my God, I would so pick you. But you you don't really have your own voice as well, and I get it. It's part of the lower. You know, he's got Baby's voice, but I feel like there's just, there's so many factors that go against you, man. That I just listed. I'm so, I'm so sorry. You're awesome. Nightmare on a Spring Trap. Spring Trap, obviously. Uh, baby, of course. Um, so now, we get to the I hate myself. <laughs> this is when, oh my god. Okay, this is, this is big no bueno. <sighs> I gotta go with a Bonnie. I'm sorry, the puppet is so awesome, but. And I know, you do so much for the lore. But honestly, and I feel like people kind of know this about me. The lore has just gone way too confusing. <laughs> Man, if we could go back to the simpler times of the lore, that would be great. Withered Bonnie, he's so cool. I love his voice, I love his design. And then we got Withered Bonnie versus the Mangle. <laughs> Withered Bonnie versus the Mangle. Oh my freaking god, I gotta go with the Mangle. I gotta go with the Mangle. Again, as cool as Withered Bonnie is, having his face just torn off, the Mangle. Oh my god, we're getting into the final ones. We're getting into... We are getting into the final ones. Okay, so Yendo or Funtime Foxy. Funtime Foxy. Um, so... We are getting into the final ones. This is insane. Oh, I need to pick this one. Springtrap or Baby? What the hell is this? Springtrap or Baby? No. I can't pick. Baby, this is gonna be the one that ultimately ends me right now. Jesus. This is gonna be the one that everyone's gonna yell at me about in the comments. Ugh. Uh, let's do this one first. Wither Chica or Nightmare Fredbear? Uh. They both have that exaggerated mouth. It's another Chica, and I'm. Oh, I always have a soft spot for Chica. Don't take that the weird way, or I will ban you from this earth. Nightmare Fredbear or Withered Chica? I love Withered Chica's voices. Vo her voice lines. I love Fredbear's voice lines. I love their designs. But ultimately, I think Nostalgia might win this in the end. I just remember all the awesome, stupid theories about Withered Chica. About how she was the one that moved the paper plate doll in the second game to the office. She was the one... Like, she was originally a cheerleader in another location because of her her t-pose and her arms up like that people thought she was a cheerleader I, I, uh, but nightmare fred but you're so iconic as well but you're also just a freaking illusion I, I, nostalgia you are a piece of crap and i hate you but i've got to go with it fun time fox you have scrap baby scrap baby obviously scrap baby oh my god we're getting into the final ones Okay, so, let's see, Springtrap or Baby, Springtrap or Baby, Springtrap or Baby, Springtrap, he, he honestly just feels like he's just kind of here now, like when you really think about it, Afton's story is complete, it's complete, it ends with him non-stop in Custom Night, in Hell, in Purgatory, constantly being tormented, like his, his time's kind of over, his time in the spotlight, and then Baby, I feel like she's taking over a bit more. The thing is, like, there's not much to Baby. Like, her story's over as well, when you think about it. Because Elizabeth, she gets 
possess she possesses baby once she gets scooped um and then what she turns into Ender. Ender turns into Molten Freddy. Molten Freddy dies in in Pizza Sim. So everyone, like both their stories are kind of over. Design wise, I'd probably go with Baby just because like she's freaking massive. And again, I'm I'm a sucker for the fun time animatronics. Mm, and her reveal, her reveal was freaking top notch. But again, the nostalgic theories about Springtrap. Nostalgic theories about Springtrap. Uh, Springtrap, he's a little lackluster as well. His design is awesome, but his jump scare is horrible. The jump scares in FNAF 3 are so... Uh, I gotta go with Baby. Okay, so we are in the final stretch. Scrap Baby versus Withered Chica versus Circus Baby versus The Mangle. Who will prevail? Don't freaking know. Okay, so Baby or Withered Chica? Withered Chica, if, again, if you had a unwithered game, I would pick you, but you don't. Scott, get on to that. Okay, so Scrap Baby. I can't have Scrap Baby versus Baby. I gotta go with the Mangle. So, <laughs> the Mangle or Circus Baby? Mangle or Circus Baby? Mangle versus Circus Baby. I love both their designs, I love both of their voices. I love both their backstories. Uh, <laughs> well, baby. Uh, I, I just thought about her mechanic in Custom Night again. It's it's reused. You have the same mechanic as two other characters. Mangle. Where where was Mangle again? Mangle's in the vents. You're just easy to deal with in Custom Night. Well, both of you are easy to deal with in Custom Night. Um, Circus Baby, I love your mini games in Help Wanted. Mangle, I love your mini games in Help Wanted. Oh, frick. I just. The one thing I want is Toy Foxy. I want to know what Toy Foxy looks like. I mean, we kind of know what Toy Foxy looks like because of that, uh, that super early teaser with the hook. Oh. Frick me, this is, this is awful. Can I pick both of them? <laughs> I've just been sad here, I'm like, I'm just, I just want to pick both of them. But I can't, I have to pick one. <laughs> this is, this is actually horrible. I, fr I freaking hate this. Oh, I love the theories about both of them. More, more Mangle, I guess. Because Mangle just has the most theorizable stuff. Like, Circus Baby... We kind of know a lot more. Thing is, with like the the newer games, it's easier to figure out what's going on, and it's the only tough part about it is like connecting it to everything else, because there's just so much. But back in the early days, there was so much to interpretation. What is Mango really saying in in their static? Did Mango really cause the bite of eighty seven? I don't freaking. I'm I'm going Mango. I gotta go Mango. Mango is the winner. Mangle is Johnny Blox's favorite character. That was freaking tough. And I still don't know if I'm fully satisfied. It does feel nice though. Mangle, saying Mangle is my favorite, it does it does feel nice. But thinking about it, re really, really thinking about it, I, I do. I am satisfied with that answer. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully, you guys won't get too mad at me over who I picked. Again, all of this is my opinion. It's my personal opinion. I would love for you guys to take this test, and then you guys can tell me in the comments who your favorite character is. It's difficult. It's freaking insane, but yeah, that this is this is it. Um, I'm happy with it. I'm super happy with it. So again, take the quiz for yourself. Tell me in the comments below who your favorite character is, and I will see you guys on the flip side. Goodbye.